हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू कामत एस्ट्रोलॉजी सो टुडे वी विल टॉक ऑन एन इंटरेस्टिंग टॉपिक एंड आई हैव बीन रिसीविंग मेनी क्वेश्चंस अराउंड दिस सो आई थॉट आई विल डू सम एनालिसिस एंड द क्वेश्चन मोस्ट कॉमनली आस्ट इज व्हिच कंट्री विल रशिया नेक्स्ट इनवेड सो आई हैव डन अ शॉर्ट एनालिसिस एंड let us try to understand this analysis whether this really happens or not is something we need to wait for and see so i want you to have a look at this map currently russia has already invaded ukraine so i was trying to see which other country it is most likely to invade i went through the charts of many other countries here mainly poland slovakia Serbia also, and I could zero down on this red square, which shows the small region of Moldova and Romania. So when I analyzed the chart of Moldova and also the current transits, I see a strong possibility that Russia can extend the invasion further into Moldova. now let us look at the charts of moldova moldova obtained independence from the erstwhile ussr on 27th august 1991 the time is approximately 12 pm and the capital of moldova is chisinau so this is the independence chart of moldova now when i analyzed this chart there are certain interesting things like currently moldova is running the mahadasha of mercury antardasha of jupiter and the pratyantar of ketu you can see saturn and sun are forming a shadashtak yog in the chart of moldova also when moldova obtained independence in 1991 that time it was running the mahadasha of the sixth lord that is jupiter in this chart the antardasha of rahu and pratyantar dasha of surya or the sun who is the 11th lord in this chart so the 6th lord indicates conflicts and that was the time when ussr split and this country of moldova was formed so i thought that this country let us analyze the transit chart i took the transit chart of 25th march 2024 the time around the lunar eclipse and in that i found a very interesting combination the ascendant lord in moldova's independence chart that is venus is now in the transit chart forming a conjunction with saturn and mars and you can see that mars is the planet of aggression saturn and mars conjunction represents protests violence terrorist activities and since the ascendant lord is also with saturn and mars here this can be a time when russia can plan for some disturbances within moldova now because saturn and mars are together here it indicates a protest between the people of moldova and the armed forces of moldova or the government supported armed forces in moldova also this is happening in the fifth house that is in the sign of aquarius in transit now if sixth house indicates disintegration indicates a conflict fifth house indicates a union which means that this small country is now likely to merge back with russia this could happen due to certain rebel groups present in this country but again when i see this time frame this is the only condition and that may not really indicate that russia may attack moldova in this time but it does indicate that within moldova 
rebel groups will intensify their protests in this time you can see sun is also with rahu in this time around 25th march so it indicates the beginning of a rebellion or a protest in moldova however around 23rd april 2024 mars will be with rahu in the sign of pisces activating an angarak yog in moldova's natal chart and that is the possible time when this country will really get into conflict so a lot of violence can be expected once the angarak yog gets formed so friends from 25th march 2024 definitely some kind of struggle begins in this country However I see a proper invasion happening between 8th and 26th April 2025 This is because from 8th April 2025 there will be Mercury Mahadasha Jupiter Antardasha Rahu Pratyantar and this time points to a war in this country So friends that's all from my end if you like this video do mark it as liked on YouTube If you have any queries write to us at astrosevaworld@yahoo.com you can also visit our website astrosevaw.tripod.com to reach out to us so friends thanks a lot bye take care and stay safe